taper. Here's one way to doing it, getting under that sort of load variant mindset. This is a great finishing combination to your back workout. Coach is going to show us. First, we're going to start with a free motion lat pullover. He's going to pop out 12 or 15 reps of these with continuous tension, so a real focus on, on deliberately moving the weight. Nice straight arms. Beautiful. If we wanted to, we could use the uh, free motion out wider. So if Coach was doing those, he'd do about 15 reps. That's good, Coach. Got it. Yeah. And then he's going to move right in to the reverse grip push-up that we talked about. Again, because we want that lower lat emphasis, so he's already activated the lats. And now we're going to get another plane of motion effect on the lats. Great for bringing the lat work in. As Coach said earlier, he used these in his powerlifting career for involving the lats. So this combination of free motion pullover with the reverse grip push-up, fantastic for the lower lats. Try three sets of those, you'll feel those the next day, right Coach? Yeah, just doing that little one that we did there, not even a full set, and you can already feel my lower lats start to cramp doing that. And that's an area that a lot of people have a hard time hitting. So two great exercises to do that. And that's the payoff, is doing them together. That's the free motion pullover with the reverse grip, wide push-ups for the lower